He did that right after <laughs> Lava. Yeah. Hey, what's up, guys? It's Arlie, and I'm here with another video. I hope you guys like the setup. It's um, it's through OBS, so I don't have to really go and have to edit videos like that. If it's a reaction video, we can kind of just do it right now. Okay. So I got some wine. I don't know what you're drinking. What are you drinking? Same. But mine's in a wine glass. Yeah. It's not a lot of wine, so no. you can't expect us to get drunk. But <laughs> um, yeah, actually, guys, getting drunk, like drunk to where you can't do anything, is stupid. Like, get drunk to just balance out and feel like good, but don't do it to like don't overdo it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like it's I dumb. Know. Don't <laughs> don't do Man. it. It's, it's fucking dumb. <laughs> don't don't do it, bro. Basically telling them, don't be like me. It's crazy because there's a lot of teenagers that was drinking before I was. And I'm over here trying to tell them how to drink. <laughs> yeah. Hey, I mean, if they're drinking, you might as well show them how to. No, I'm dead. Hold on, <laughs> hold on. I'm trying to figure out how to freaking move this to where... See what I mean? Oh, I see what's going on. Okay, so what you do here is you go to the video... And then you crop it to where the video is the video. It, it's it's weird. I hope I explained that well, YouTube. I'm setting <laughs> up OBS. I'm over here doing some editing inside OBS while filming. This is ridiculous, you know. How much further can I go? Oh, that's enough. That's enough to know. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Why does it always do that when I'm just trying to all... Okay. There we go. It's getting there. It's getting back to where it was. There it is. Like right there is fine. And see, this is harder than people think it is. Hold on. See what I'm talking about? Shit like that. Like, <laughs> bruh. Just work. Just work. That's all I ask. Just do your job, okay? It ain't that hard. No, but basically... Alright. Anyways, we are reacting to 10 most dangerous selfies ever taken. Here we go. Number 10. Active volcano selfie. Lava is awesome from a distance, but while conventional wisdom advises most people to run from the fiery molten rock, extreme selfie artists head straight to the heat. In August 2014, Toronto based storm chaser George Coronis snapped this selfie in front of an active volcano. Clad in a futuristic looking suit, he couldn't resist taking a photo of himself to a backdrop of the active Benbo volcano on Ambram Island in Vanuatu. He, he got lucky that he did not get, like... Get hit with anything. No, yeah. he got lucky. Because if he would have got hit, it would have been a wrap. Oh my god. <laughs> he would have been... <laughs> <laughs> His that. body would have melted. Oh. A bear selfie, that's not that bad. Well, let's watch the video The notorious bear selfie trend, which took off in 2014, is a trend so reckless, officials have issued a safety warning pleading for it to stop. Increasingly high numbers of visitors to South Lake Tahoe, California, are putting themselves at risk of an attack or mauling in order to get a shareable snap of themselves with a bear in the background. The U.S. Forest Service says visitors are risking their lives in the hunt for a unique profile picture by approaching the bears. Although bear attacks are rare, the risk of one taking place unsurprisingly increases if the animals are provoked by the presence of humans. In particular, female bears with cubs will charge if they perceive a threat on their cubs. Number 8. Christ the Redeemer. What? Wait, Christ the... Many thrill seekers have oh, taken photos. That's actually, I mean, that's not really... Is that really risky? Well, he's no, no, no. It's a statue. It's a really, really tall statue. Like, and he's climbing mm. on top of it. I mean, it, does he have a harness? As long as I mean, 
I don't have a thing that bad. The famous statue in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. This one, taken by Lee Thompson, the founder of solo travel company Flashpack, is among the most stomach churning. The 31 year old managed to take a selfie of himself from the summit of the 120 foot high Brazilian landmark, scaling a narrow and tiny, very tight staircase at the last leg of the climb, from which one misplaced step could lead you to fall a long way. Have you seen that movie 2012? Yeah. Yeah, they had it to where this fell apart in that movie. Oh, God. That's terrible. Number seven. That's great for a selfie. No, that is not that bad. If they're on top of a building, I don't think it's... Oh, my God. Oh, 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 my God. Now, they are nuts. They oh, are nuts. my God. They are That's per suicide. <laughs> That is suicide. For 19-year-old <laughs> Russian photographer Alexander Remnev, climbing them and taking selfies is what does the trick. Remnev has traveled to Hong Kong, Paris, Barcelona, and Dubai there, whoa. for skyscrapers to climb. Whoa. He scaled every tall Russian structure. Hey, they living on edge. They say, fuck it. You know, <laughs> they're crazy. Dubai, including Moscow Bridge and Kiev, Ukraine. <gasps> Remnev and his buddies bring along... Oh, yeah, that's, 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 that's the one I remember a while ago. He also traveled with his friends to Dubai to scale several skyscrapers oh. in the city. This photo shows him and a friend... They got no fear. They, they got balls. Room. They definitely got balls on that. I mean, the thing is, I can do stuff like that if I know for sure that there's a possibility that I won't fall. Like, if I know there's an extra step hold or, like, a, they just, like they, they, just they, they all on edge. Like, there is no type of safety parameter to know if you can they fall. Just did it. Like, they just did it. They're fucking. That's just wild. They're, they're crazy. That's wild. <laughs> the tower is a 101 story and 414 meters, 1,350 feet tall. This man looked like he from Uncharted. Oh, Nathan Drake had ass. <laughs> <laughs> Number Wait a minute. That, yeah. You know, it makes you think, are these real or are they not? But they're obviously real. No, they're real as hell. They're just crazy. Number six. Selfie at the devil's pool. Selfie at the devil's pool? Even photos of the devil's pool Bruh. in India are enough to make your stomach turn. But it has recently been the site of many selfies. A lot of people have died there, there too. Pool, thanks to its location at the top of the iconic That's Victoria not a good Falls, selfie. the world's largest waterfall. And right on the Did you hear what they said? Oh, That's the world's largest, largest waterfall. waterfall. So oh if you fall off, you're dead. Even if you hit water. They obviously want to, they obviously want to do suicide. They obviously want to do that. Just so near inches away from the edge before the they huge sheer drop of Victoria Falls and pose excitedly for photos. Uh, oh. Now that one's just too dangerous. That one's too much. That one's too much. How, how did they not fall? They just probably had their, they probably had their foot on a rock. In the water uh, or something. Yeah. That's what I'm Call thinking. Yeah. One slip or trip, and you <laughs> could end up falling straight off the edge. They said one slip or a trip. They're crazy. Oh my god. I like I like how that's a rainbow though. It's pretty. They are insane. The devil's pool. That's why it's called the devil's pool. One trip and it's a wrap. Number five, <laughs> gun selfie. I mean, that's not really a big deal. Oh, well, that's what the A video. trend for posting gun selfies to social media, where the person is holding a gun or even pointing it at their own head, has had unforeseen consequences in various instances. There are several tragic accounts of people losing their lives after accidentally shooting themselves while... <gasps> whoa! 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 <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with this lady? Whoa. Okay, that's Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, that child that child is traumatized. That child's got to be traumatized. It's looking at the gun. That's not cool. 
Can I can I shoot that mother? What? So look at look at that. What? Bo Bo. I don't give a fuck if you're trying to do a selfie. Why? That's not cool. That did like, she get arrested? I don't know. I hope she did. I, I, I hope her child's gotten taken away from her. That's, that's not cool. Others being caught huh? committing crimes. She won't bother. Like this. Arrested. Like people, they take pictures with guns and then they go and do a crime, but they took a picture and put it on Facebook. That's crazy. They just told them themselves. For three bank robberies in Michigan, after posing a photo of himself with a gun to Facebook. Number four. With the rise in the popularity of different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Snapchat, the addiction among teenagers or even adults to constantly document their lives in these platforms through selfies is also increasing. Now I could, I could and sit on a cliff and be okay. People get more concerned with capturing the perfect selfie rather than... You know what I noticed too, though, to be honest? Like, she's the person in this video, right? So they're saying, like, people are... Like with the rise in popularity of these social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Snapchat, people feel like they constantly have to document every part of their lives mm -hmm. to get likes yep. and get popularity. But, man. Moreover, to get a perfect smile, people constantly put their lives at risk. This photo shows a group of Indian youth taking a selfie at the very top edge <coughs> of the cliff. Number three. Selfie with Cobra. We often pose with animals to take pictures during our holidays. <laughs> These are the snakes. most like dangerous snakes. One of the most dangerous fucking poisonous snakes in the world. And you want to take a picture next to it. You're just asking to die. <laughs> could agitate the wild creature and ultimately harm Well, I also noticed these people are also good with snakes. With a because of where they're living at. Maybe. Deadly cobra wrapped around its neck and jawed purr. The man, while posing, did not realize that the reptile had bitten him and lost his life hours later. This. So he took a picture with the snake, got bit, didn't realize died. he got bit and died. Teen also lost his the poison. life after kissing a cobra while taking a selfie. Number two. Running at the bulls. While taking part in one of the world's most epic events, it's only natural to want to document the experiment. Turns out, capturing a cool selfie could also mean getting trampled to death by angry bulls. I'm <laughs> gonna <laughs> on the ground. It's not a game. Wow. Number one. Train truck selfie. What? It's never a good idea to stand on the railway tracks or anywhere near them when a train is approaching. It not only puts yourself in tremendous danger, but also places the passengers and staff on board at risk. That actually of. looks cool, but that shit is dangerous. Four teenagers decided to take a selfie at the railway in Pure Wardjo, Indonesia, when suddenly, a train rushes past, and one of their friends who is right at the back gets hit by the train's force, which causes her to fly forward a few meters. Oh my god. Did she lose her life? Yeah. Oh, she was just a teenager. I'm telling you, like, don't do it. Just don't do it. Don't do it. It's not worth dying over. It really wow. is not worth dying over, is it? Social media is not worth dying over. And you know what? I, like, I can't even blame most of these teenagers because they're watching grown people do it. I they're know, watching they're watching grown adult people. Adult people act stupid and take selfies just for, just for, just to have all these likes and all these popularities on social media. Like, it's not even that serious. Like, they're letting people let social media dictate their life. It's true. That's so, oh my that's god, so, that girl. That's scary, man. Just don't do it. Just don't do it, okay? Just No, please don't. It's not worth it. Your no. life matters way more than social media. <laughs> like, I swear. <laughs> oh my god. That's crazy because people say YouTube is bad. 
but all we do is make videos on We make reaction videos. Or or we play games or something like or make a vlog. We're not out here trying to kill ourselves. Hell, you know, like it's Man. uh anyways, Islanders, make sure you subscribe, okay? And Ally Cat Allie's gonna make her a Twitch account, so maybe you guys can follow her and check her out. Maybe if you want to. And uh thank you so much and peace.